Our verse today is Luke chapter 6, verse 41. Why do you see the speck that is in your brother's eye, but do not notice the log that is in your own eye? This is a very popular verse. And this verse comes within the context of the teaching of Jesus on the plain. After his teaching on the Beatitudes and the love of enemies, Jesus teaches about judging others. And in verse 37, he says, Judge not, and you will not be judged. Condemn not, and you will not be condemned. Forgive, and you will be forgiven. The injunction of Jesus not to judge culminates in our verse, highlighting the reason why we cannot and should not pass judgment on others. There is an adage in Esa, my language, that when someone bends down to look at someone else's back, he or she exposes himself or herself for others to see. Why did Jesus say we should not judge? Our verse offers some tips. First, we should not be concerned about others and forget to look at ourselves. Sometimes we may focus so much on what others are doing and not doing and lose sight of my weaknesses. Second, what you see in others may be a reflection of what we are doing or sometimes may be a projection of myself. Third, what we condemn others for may indicate that we have a bigger challenge to address in those areas. This is not always the case, but these are tips that can help us reflect on ourselves. What is the solution? St. Teresa of Avila offers some help, self-knowledge. We are quick to pass judgment on others because we do not know ourselves enough or we want to escape focusing on our weaknesses. We therefore project them to others. How do I know myself? St. Teresa encourages us to spend time with the Lord in prayer. It is by meditating on the life of our Lord Jesus Christ and just opposing our lives against His that we can see our weaknesses. Another way to know our weaknesses is we need to listen to what others say about us. Sometimes what people say that irritate us are most likely areas we need to work on in our lives. They could be the comfort zones or dark regions we do not want others to enter. Today, the Lord invites us to focus on our weaknesses rather than on the shortcomings of others. Does it mean that we cannot talk about the weaknesses of others? No. What it means is that when we talk about others, we must also reflect ourselves to ensure that what we are saying about others do not apply to me or to us. Or if it applies to me, that I acknowledge that I am also struggling with the same weakness. Lord, give me the grace to focus on my life. Please give me a genuine knowledge of myself and the courage to confront my weaknesses. Amen. And I invite you to share your thoughts and your comments on this verse in our YouTube channel, on Facebook, and let us continue to reflect each day on the verse of the Bible. God bless you.